Back. Ladies and gentlemen, Tankers of Blitz Universe. Yes, I do read your comments and I did read those subtitles on, on the yesterday's video. Or well, actually kind of tomorrow or this morning because it was a re-upload of the video. I had to redo a little bit of the of the uh, transitions and then it was also a problem with the green screen that I did not set to chroma key because of updates in Filmora and some very loud music in the beginning and in the end. And just it wasn't uh, it wasn't the quality that I usually do, so I decided to, to send it to private, re-upload, and this is actually today's video weekend gaming experience with a little bit of salt thrown in there, and a little bit, a little bit of camping, and some fun fun replays that have uh, that have been sent to me. We are looking at driving underscore rain uh cloudless player in the t34 dash 2g ft that tier 7 chinese tank destroyer he sent me this game with a bit of a description as well which is kind of good because sometimes i get a simply an email with a replay sometimes i get uh, an email with just a replay stating you must watch this and there's just too many stuff being sent to me i can't just watch them all if you don't provide anything to i don't know really re really show me uh why i should watch a replay then sorry guys I'm, I'm not gonna watch it and that's not because i do not appreciate you taking the time to send me the replay but it kind of looks like you then just i don't know sit in the game and then uh click on the share button right away and do not you have to you have to uh, add a description to it while uh while driving rainier is uh, fight this gun for the first time <laughs> In one and a half minutes into the game, the Tiger 1 is getting pummeled and then he shoots again and he misses. Where did that shot go? I didn't see a shell burst in, in, in the dirt, nor did it hit the Tiger by the looks of it. But yeah, he, he's not been very fortunate in his shooting. But that's your weekend gaming experience. You get stuff like this, so I, I'll, just, uh, I'll just have a sip now. It's easy to, to, to grab some coffee or a, or a drink or some light refreshments or snacks with condiments and um, stuff where you just enjoy and enhance the gaming experience which is really much fun in the weekend. What are you doing there, E25? You are you are a sneaky little tank going up on the hill getting spotted all the time. That doesn't really work. Happy New Year, says the T3485 on the green team. E25 has <laughs> the... Uh, has time to respond, and then the comment says, I'm not happy. No, that's probably because you're dead now. That said, Driving Rain is now finally leaving his camping spot after having done 746 damage in total so far. And this is by no means an OP replay. I've read the comments that you've uh, posted on that uh, Please Tell Me video, and there were a lot of players who said, I like this mod, and you're finally featuring the average players, the players that do not play this game uh, very much, that uh, do watch a little bit of YouTube from time to time, but we are not players that really take the game that seriously, that we can devote our entire week to it. We are not looking at lines of sight and, and DPM numbers, and um, what's going to be funny, actually, is this E25. <laughs> He's going to give some very, some very, very... Uh, specific specific uh, intelligence and info it, it's not this one careful it will come from the base well, that, well that's not rocket science and then uh, driving rain is going to miss the shot <laughs> because he fires too quickly he is not spotted because he has a camouflage net fitted on the tank and he has camo on the tank and it's a low slung tank destroyer which means it is pretty freaking stealthy you can shoot the su 100 y who is just sitting there on the cap and then look at this he spotted he sh shows up on the mini-map of reds and <laughs> still is actually one of why he decides to drive in front of his gun. And there's a very specific information that I mentioned um, that the E25 is providing now. He does 200 with max turret, one 
180 with stock. That's all well and good, uh, but um, uh, he does not know that much about the AMX 1375, who is available now as well to shoot. So let's go off the hill again. Yes, Cap is still running. This is going to be a close game. I'm going to spoil a little bit because I can already sense that you're thinking this is not, no, not an OP replay. We want uh, we want some action. We want uh, we want you to, to show us what what is needed. Martin, is this going to be any fun in this? Well, yeah, there's another. Opportunity missed <laughs> to fire, and driving range is going to uh, going to chase the AMX 1357, uh, and 57 is uh, trying to flank him. Probably he's going to be around you. He's going to go around. Yes, he's going to go around, and then driving range decides to to, to make a bit of an ambush. Knocks down a haystack, drives around his 3K 3618, and things all. Oh, the cap is already at at 70. I have to be careful. AMX are fast. Yes, they are, but they can't climb a hill. So swing the gun around, kill the AMX quickly. You have about 20 seconds now to go to reset the cap. This is going to be very tense. This is going to be very tense. All right, 86, 87. Fight back. Quick base. Yes, quick base. We're on the way. Another sip. 93, 94, 95, 96. Swing the gun around. Come on, mate. Come on. Drive it like you stole it, 99, 100, game lost, as you want it, down. What is it going to be? Victory! Yes, second class medal. Well, that ain't, that ain't OP replay. No, but it was a fun one to watch. And he sent me this game. <laughs> I like watching it. I honestly thought they had lost it once it popped to 100. Enemy team captured the base, but he managed to clear it anyway. If you can do, if that happens in supremacy, as the clock hits 1,000 and then you kill the last remaining tank, you still lose. But apparently, on an encounter, there's about two or three seconds left after they capture the base, and then you, uh, then you can still kill them and win the game. And speaking about capturing a base, this is his royalty from uh, the Legion clan, and he is platooned up with Smash 165 in the mouse. I was a bit surprised to see Smash not running the uh, the Legion camouflage on the mouse that they managed uh, to grab after winning the the Twister Cup. But Royalty is going to have a great game. Misses the first shot on the Waffle. Was worth the shot trying to take that that snapshot in. Uh, obviously, the FE 215B has a great gun. It's it's more of a but it's a sniping heavy. Has that speed boost available, and he misses his second shot as well. Is this a sign of things to come? Is this a sign of things to come? There is a T-5041. Oh, that one went in. We're going to see later if it did any form of damage. Yeah, it did some damage. Cool. Right. First shot in. Keep that in mind. It's about 400 extra damage added. There goes the FE-215B. Yes, one shot in. And then three. That is a low roll. Low roll. Bless you. And then he's going to shoot the Yakuan z to Track him in place. Good. 390. Good roll. 46, 47, 48 on the cap. Cap has been reset. And they've lost... Uh, They've lost a tank, so that's not good. Still, it is uh, it's six versus seven, so that should uh, should be a uh, it is a five versus seven. That should be no problem if you have uh, a good team to help you. You can shoot the dark ones at on the right. Let's get stuck in. Try to deal some more damage. It, it it's four versus seven. Things are starting to not look that brilliant now, but still four versus seven. Might be doable if you can uh, keep your uh, your friend alive. Yes, clear player underscore number thingy the Yakpans the on it, and then royalty is going to go in. All guns blazing, Yolo Remo moves down. He wants to keep smashing the mouse three one three alive. There we go. Waffle is not interested in the FE two one five B, which is a mistake I think because he gets rammed into and then shot with hash. There we go on the gun shield. Boom. Good one. Five sixteen roll. And Royalty is up to 3.4, 3.5k damage in total. T54 you want is taken out, but not before he manages to take out the mouse. And that's unfortunate. It is now a 3 versus 4. And 3 versus 4 might not be uh, too bad, considering that Royalty has a lot of health left. But if you have been um, looking at, uh, at the lineup a little bit, and if you have been looking at the tanks he has been shooting, there's two FE215Bs uh, on the red team, and an E100, and uh, this WZ121, and that is a lot of hit points, 
uh, one really big gun, two tanks with great DPM and uh, a big gun, a big alpha medium tank. The 121 is taken out by the, by the IS-7 as you can see, but not at the cost of yet another shell from the 121. And this, F, uh, this IS-7, he is a bit of a, yeah, yeah he has just become a one-shot. <laughs> You don't have the gun to pressure, mate. You're, you're trying to rush an FV215B, and that IS-7 is just dying to get damage in. He wants to take that kill. He is maybe a bit too eager. Well, what are you doing, Waffle? No, 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 do not. Uh, what's the Waffle doing? That's not how you should. You should play your Waffle. Uh, be a bit aggressive in a way because you got a big gun. But if he misses, yeah, he missed. Did you see the shell burst? He missed and he got instantly cleared by Watchback in the FV215B. And now Royalty is in a bit of a pickle here. He is in the low ground. He cannot support the IS-7. He has to deal with two FV215Bs and nearly full health E100. And luckily the IS-7 manages to clear uh, the FV215B on the red team. At least one of them. But uh, the big guy is still alive. The big dog. The tank with the most health left come on mate yes good one you're running the radium shield that that shields you from a little bit of damage that would have been a 640 plus roll into the back maybe even with a g a bit more this fe215b is running the speed boost the is7 cannot keep up shoot him in the back hash yes 509 good roll the engine is down oh, that's gonna hurt in the morning clear the fe yes <sighs> he did manage to clear the fe but at what cost? Well, you can do the mess yourself. But there was a lot, a lot of hit points flying off of the FV215B from his royalty. And he is held down now and he can start shooting this E100. But he has to resort to APCR. He doesn't quite have the time to aim it properly. And his E100 can just start rolling in. Yes, use the carcass of the Waffle Tractor. Back to AP. There we go. Knock down 6,600 damage dealt. Yes, one more shot. There we go. Is, is he going to bounce a shot from the E100? Is he going to do it? 7,000 damage. Shoot him again. Maybe track him. Good shot. 425. Just one more shot left. He is out of AP. He has to resort to APCR. E100 is rushing. Shoot him. Track him. And... No! Oh! 215 damage left. 215 hit points left. 8,190 damage dealt. A massive base XP. But what a heartbreaking loss over there. That's also a weekend gaming experience, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much. By the way, your teammates are not really in a position or have the skill level to uh, to help you out. To really to really make the game work as intended. They, can, they cannot take advantage of positions you take. They cannot take advantage of you holding a flank or your DPM. But sometimes it does work. And Wakanda Forever is going to show us that. And he's going to go forward on False Creek. Because he is uh, he's slow and he's going to tell the team. Go left. I'm going to hold right. I'm in the mouse. I've got the other camel. The legionary camel. I have a grill with me. I'm gonna be just fine. He's platooned up with uh, Brinziger from Loka Clan, who's in the Progetto 65. So that is good to know. That is the auto reloading tier 10 um, Italian tank. I'm gonna shoot this tier 110E5, not in the lower plane, bounce that shot. But he also blocks one shot from the tier 110E5 and blocks a shot from the WZ11114, the tier 9 Chinese heavy tank. And he's going to side scrape you like a mother boss. Angle the turret, hide the lower plate, bounce one more shot, 515. There was a heat shell from the grill. And here they come. Here comes the E50. Bounce one. 1675 blocked. You ain't seen nothing yet. He's gonna block some more. That's the grill behind him. It's good to have that grill there. Otherwise, he would have been rushed. And uh, he doesn't want to get rushed. Because there's an AMX 50B in front of him, there's the E50M, shoot him, and yes, drive backwards ever so slowly, use a repair kit, angle into the rock again, blocking one more shot from the AMX, the grill is gonna go down fighting, yes, but he did manage to knock some health off that E50M, and Wakanda is just gonna roll back down, that's the first damage taken, yet another block shot, are we counting? 
You're taking a look over there, 3,375, yes, one more, one more shot damage taken, one more block, one more block, ding ding, there they come, they're just popping off, and all these rats are thinking, we have to go in there now, we have to go in, look at this guys, we got the mouse, we got him cornered over there, we've got him cornered, and upon re-watching this replay as he blocks uh, a shot from this wolf attractor, I cannot understand why the rats are not just focusing on Brini in the Progetto 65 and they are just looking at him oh god look at that he's become a one shot let's go in let's go in I want to kill I want to kill the mouse I want to kill the mouse I want to go forward I want to kill the mouse there's the MX 50P there's the T 125 down below the leopard to war survive there's the E50M who's trying to resort to HE shoot him yes oh that shot misses that's unfortunate this HE shot's coming from medium tanks on a mouse with 700 something health so much luck says the AMX 50B no mate this is just great gameplay just holding that corner and then slowly inching backwards and then just sitting here i was thinking he's gonna drop off but he's not he's hiding his lower plate he's hiding his tracks he's hiding all the squishy bits all the fleshy parts and he just held the line 8305 damage blocked but that's not all there's gonna be another shot here it is yes yes should be should be well, he's gonna block 8.6k. Thank you very much. He doesn't have the gun pressure to shoot the leopard. But he was instrumental in winning. And Wakanda Forever just held the line there. XD says the leopard. GG AMX. And here comes a word from Brainy in a Progetto. You're OP, mate. <laughs> Thank you, Wakanda, for sending uh, that game into me and allowing me to use it on the channel. Only a third class, but a monstrous Spartan Flash. Steel Wall Melon. This goes to show, ladies and gentlemen, tankers of this universe. You don't have to deal damage to have great games. You can block uh, 7k or 8k and then have a good one. And then it goes, goes um, on my channel as well for your viewing pleasure. Enjoy the weekend. I'll catch you all on the next video. Cheers, happy tanking and bye-bye.